Hello friends, Marcy here. It's a haul day. I'm telling you, my poor postman uh, got a workout. Um, so I have some items to share with you. As you can see, two of them are goulet. I'll be opening these with you in just a quick moment. Um, there's probably gonna be too much in there to share on, I like to make my videos kind of short as not to take up too much of your time at one time, but I can give you a teaser about what's to come as we share what's inside. Um, I'm excited about this one. This is from a pen friend, a dear pen friend, Roberta. We communicate a lot. We have so much in common. She's like my twin sister that I never had. Um, but she purchased herself something and she thought of me and purchased one for me as well. So I'm going to get into this box, show you what's inside is my little present. It's not even Christmas or my birthday, but it's a happy day. So here we are. Um, I took the contents out of the box in the packaging bag. Um, isn't that a gorgeous box? I love it, love it, love it. It reminds me, let me might move my candle out of the way here. <clears throat> it reminds me of my um, washi tapes from uh, Lauren Phelps design with the script on there. Aren't those gorgeous? Like I have an assortment of quite a few designs. But anyway, I love, I love that style. The old writing, that's why I enjoy fountain pens because I love this. Anyway, note from my friend, Roberta. She tucked in her note to me. It was so sweet to think of me. I just, I'm amazed, I'm blessed. So thank you so much, Roberta. Um, I'm gonna move this out of the way. And, oh, this is like it's been stamped with love. Department eight. <laughs> All right. Oh. oh my goodness. Wow, isn't this amazing? Look at these nibs. Okay, I'm gonna have to read on there to see what each, oh, all right. I've never owned like a calligraphy set like this before. This is amazing. Um, but these are numbered one, two, three, four, five. And they have like the italic uh, grind on there. If you can see, I hope I'm getting this a good uh, picture that's not blurred. Um, wide and it gets more narrow as the numbers increase the width of that metallic grind um, goes down more narrow and then these I'm gonna have to read about this look at these fabulous points so this is um, dip nibs this one is really unique Wow since I hope I'm in frame. I apologize if I moved out. I'm just, I'm like, I'm looking at the box being all amazed and enthused and I'm not paying attention to what y'all can see, but this has like a double layer. I have a lot to investigate here. Um, but, and there's also a nib already on this um, wooden pen. So let me try to pull this out. A little bow tie on the elastic, how cute, a little bow ribbon. Um, this is a wooden handle with a nib and I'm not able to read that writing. I'll have to get my little uh, part to my Goulet um, nib fixer uh, magnifier there that I have and go over these, but isn't it gorgeously designed? Let's see if I can get it to where you can see the scroll and design on there. That is beautiful. So the nibs are interchangeable here. And, oh man, okay, how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven nibs on this with a bottle of dip ink. And it's called the Feather Ink, the writing collection. So I am going to read about this and teach myself how to properly use all these fine tools for gorgeous calligraphy because I love it. Um, purchasing, when I first started using fountain pens about four years ago, I was purchasing fine and extra fine nibs because I've always enjoyed um, those kind of um, nib tips 
even on a ballpoint pen like my Klena is a 0.38, I always enjoy really fine tips. Um, and I started in fountain pens like that, and then I, um, a few mediums, but once I tried a stub 1.1 nib, oh my goodness, there I went on a whole new tangent, um, collecting all the stub nibs, um, cause they're just fun. Like here's one right here. This is my little Twisby, um, mini, a diamond mini white and rose gold. And it has the, um, J Urban. Uh, Blue Ocean, which you can see it's a beautifully shimmered ink, and I love writing with this. I have stub nibs in my other pens as well, but I, I just gravitate to pulling this out. I don't know if this color is the size of the pocket pen or what, but I'm having a ball um, with all of this. So Roberta um, bought herself, um, I can get that up, I'm going to leave it like that. Roberta bought herself the same set, and we were... Um, talking this morning about doing a collab, maybe a collab together video and I can share hers, she can share mine. So we're going to set something up fabulous for y'all um, regarding this this wonderful calligraphy set. I'm, gonna, I'm tired, tired, tired. Um, so we'll get back to you. I'll let you know more about that as it comes because this video today is an unboxing, but it's going to be a kind of an introduction to a lot of stuff that I need to share with you at a later time or the video will just be horrendously long. Um, so let's, let me tell you, I'm gonna do a little funny right here. Get ready to ha ha with me. Um, this is not a criticism at all, but when I pulled this on my mailbox, the first thought that came to my mind was the ridiculous amount of care and I hope I'm not missing anything in that box. <laughs> it's, um, it's not a criticism. I just like, oh no, my ridiculous amount of care. I hope I'm not missing anything, so. Uh, Goulet, not a criticism. It's just it, it, your your phrases are ingrained into my mind, and it's like that's the first thing I missed today. So let me start with. So I just had to get the invoice out of the way real quick. And another beautiful, like turtle art design from Miss Ellie Goulet, age eight at the time of this artwork. Love the stickers and our card. Um, there's our slightly ridiculous amount of care that made me laugh. Not a criticism. Again, you, you brought a smile to my face today. So um, I've been waiting on this Monteverde mini ink converter. That's something that I wanted. That's why it was in the first order. Um, and I ensured that that was one of the few items that I placed in the order right away. I'll tell you more about that in a moment. But we have... We have, everything is packed so well inside, so nothing was lost. There you go. Um, another bin new, another bin new. So this is joining a family, and I'll tell you more about that after, in a few minutes. I'm, I'm having a, a family of bin new pins. They're just amazing. Recent discovery. Um, and an ink sample, which, let me share with you, is another uh, up, upcoming video. This is the J.R. Bond 1670. Um, I I don't know if I could pronounce that name. It's Karub, Karube de Chipre, Chipre. I don't know, but there you go. You can see the letters and uh, try to understand my phonetic pronunciation. Um, and this is going to go, let me show you another upcoming video that I've been trying to uh, organize. Um, but this little tray arrived like the day before we went on vacation, so it, I haven't set it up yet. But I got it for my sample collections. There's more to add, and I have more coming in. Um, and I'm also, I saw this on someone's video, and I apologize for not knowing who, but they had swatches on the top of their bottle caps, and I was like, how'd they do that? And I realized that they were using the... Um, binder reinforcement rings that you put on pages when they rip in a binder and then they swatched the color on the top of the cap so it's like boom there you go this is an, a future video that i'm going to work with you trying to set up um this tray that i got from amazon and karen god bless your heart karen shared this with me on a message and it's like oh man i feel bad because She's sharing it with me because she knew it's something I needed and I already received one in the mail and I've been lax on, not lax, but busy, 
busy, busy, busy and gone. Um, and trying to get this stuff loaded into videos to share with y'all. But upcoming project, um, yeah. All right, back to Bennu. Again, I love the script. See, it's on that washi. It's on um, the box, the gift from Roberta. And here we go. Okay, if you've ever held the Wonderland 222 um, planner cover, this box co cover feels a lot like their cover to me. I don't know what the material is, but it's enjoyable to touch. And we have, oh, I forgot there's a cartridge in here. Oh, and these are the long cartridges, which is part of my upcoming story. This cartridge is a long cartridge. Um, this is just some packing and the warranty and some information on the pen. I'm going to move this aside, keep that handy for future discussions, and let's pop this out of our little cardboard sleeve. Oh my goodness, isn't it gorgeous? Okay, this is the Briolet Collection, and I'm going to say Amber, is it Orchid? No, I don't know. It's Briolet something Amber. Oh my goodness. I'm going to look it up and put it on the screen for you. But isn't that gorgeous? And the gold shimmer is just like what gets you. But um, this is my second of the Luminous line. And as I allow it to get sunlight from my window, um, it will charge to the, both of them. This uh, resin will charge and glow in the dark. It's amazing. Oh wow. Okay, so this is the new one. It's amber. It has a lot of brown and golds in there and like an ivory um, beige cream luminous portion. And I know this luminous portion glows blue, a, a kind of a teal, a light teal blue. Um, and this one, I don't know. We've yet to discover that, but I'll have to take pictures when that happens and share with you. Um, I don't want to do a full review yet, um, but I will show you what's included and try to get really close so you can see how pretty this is. And if you look as I twist, you can see the shine from the diamond facets and all those shapes that are included on the body barrel and the cap um, are reasons that this cap does not post because of all the shapes going on. Just, it won't fit, but that's okay because you can set it like this, or you can buy the pen holder, which is, they also have the luminous pen holders that glow um, to hold your components when you're not writing, but um, don't need it. Actually, if this posted, it would be really a really, really long pen. Um, unposted, it's still a comfortable writing uh, size. So, okay, this is a medium nib. I'm, I don't know if you can see the nib here. There's a script in the very center. There's a circle and the fancy script M for medium. Um, and I purposely bought another medium because both of my luminous, this one has the silver, this one has the gold. Let's see, I didn't want to go into comparison and review in detail. Um, but both of the luminous I bought with a medium nib and then both of my both of my others I bought with a broad. I thought I could keep track in my brain if I had some kind of pattern to organize. But this is um, comes with a converter and a cartridge. And this cartridge is really, really long. So we'll talk about that later in another another video because I need another video to explain it all. Anyway, so let's get into the second box. Um, the Goulet. And where's my knife? Okay. Um, I'm going to do this while I continue to talk. This is exciting. I'm going to get all excited. I have so much to say. I'm like talking, talking, talking in a hurry. Oop, I always do that. Please open without removing important stuff. Okay, so did I get my... 
No, okay. I thought it had paperwork in there. All right, so. Lots of samples. Okay, let's get the paper. Another Bennu. But, guys, I'm done. Yeah, I'm done. Um, I'm done. So, when you see that, don't worry. Because that is all. Oh, that's all, folks. Um, like our Looney Tunes. So, this uh, is banana. A banana Tootsie Pop. And our sticker artwork by Ellie. And... Our packing card from Brandon so all right um, this these uh, Diamine Imperial purple cartridges I purchased um, they the story goes with part of this story and this story coming up in a later video <laughs> it all has to do with cartridge size so Let's see, let me read the sample names that I have purchased. And since I have this tray here, I'm gonna go ahead and pop them in there as we go. Um, do you mean happy holidays? Yes, I'm excited about that. I wanna use this up and um, see if I'm gonna be pur purchasing bottle size or going with um, samples just for the holiday because I won't need too much of a holiday color. Um, during the holidays, so I may just be able to get away with samples. This is Diamine Seasons Greetings, and this is going to be beautiful. Um, we're going to swatch together in my swatch book. Um, this is Diamine Wine Divine, and it does have a gold shimmer. So that's a burgundy, and when I ordered this, I was kind of thinking of this pen. So that's the Ambrosia line, the Bennu Ambrosia um, Amber orchid okay and another shimmer this is Damien Coco shimmer again um, this pen so when I was ordering to experiment I had all this gorgeous color in mind this is J Urban amethyst day RL and it does have a shimmer it's a purple shimmer so you can look and see where I can use this pen Again, again. I mean, this ink in any pen. Again, again. Um, Diatromentus Brilliant Violet Copper. And this has a gorgeous, like, fuchsia shimmer. Damien Frosted Orchid. Guys, you could do this. Look. I'm so excited about these colors. Wow. All right. Um... Detrimentous Alexander Hamilton. I just wanted this because it was a deep, deep, dark purple. And I will tell you, see that deep, deep, dark purple. Um, my school colors, I changed um, schools and districts. And my school colors are deep, deep, dark purple. So I've been ordering a lot of purple lately. Yeah, collecting purple. Um, you can kind of see that happening here. Uh, let's see, we have Damien Night Sky, and this is gorgeous. I liked it because it had a lighter shimmer, which if you'll notice, the shimmer in this pen is like a gold, and with this purple, the shimmer is um, silver. So I'm kind of coordinating there um, in my intentional purpose purchases. Intentional purchases on purpose. There we go. Um, so we'll be swatching those soon. Let's get to this Bennu and so if we can extend our story a little bit so again simple box again not long cartridge this one is the Milky Way oh my goodness I imagined it to be beautiful but I'm sure what y'all are seeing on the camera is not what I'm seeing this um, you would think would be a blue pen and if you tilt it to the right light, you're getting all the purple um, depth and depth purple glitter inside this resin, along with the silver. And so beautiful Milky Way. Oh my goodness. 
Wow. Okay, so I'm going to open it. We're going to look at, we have a silver nib and this one is the broad. So these two are broad nibs and the two luminous are medium. So that's how I'm um, coordinating all that important stuff in my brain. When I ordered, I was thinking about that. Um, so let's see the long universal standard converter and the long cartridge, which brings us to the story that's gonna come up in another video because I don't want this one to be too long. But this, look at these beautiful Bindu pens. They're gorgeous. And this special little beauty right here, let me turn these around so all the caps are there. This cap happens to be in the middle. And so that is why um, these three pens get the long cartridge converter, um, they'll fit. This little one is a booger. Okay, just to show you, this is not the full review or comparison. Um, this is a short cartridge, as you can see, way short. Um, that's why I ordered these purple cartridges to go in. And then I'm gonna try out this small converter. Um, it's a Monte Verde, but I ordered it because last week I was not able to get my um, Kaweco to fit. So um, once we get this all ironed out, when I figure it out and get it all ironed out, I'll be sure to include you because I want you to know if you ever want to order a pen, you want to have the um, correct size products. Okay, so I'm going through the trials for you and we will find out the answers and I'll get back to you. So that's all we're going to open from the haul today. Oh, this came yesterday. Isn't it pretty? It's beautiful. And I have my red and blue. They're gorgeous. Um, that's all from the haul today. I have more videos that I'm just waiting to have the time to share with y'all. Um, one of them is going to be the review. I still haven't done the review on this pen. I've had it for a couple weeks. I still haven't reviewed with you. And I want to review because it's purple and I need it at school. I need to rink it up and get it going. So I'm going to be in a hurry for that one. All right. Thank you for spending some of your precious moments with me today. You have a blessed day. Bye-bye.